Okay, so today I am working on some more of the glue bottle toppers. This is the one I made the other night. And the different beads. I will just slug this little bead. Bring it over here. I've moved my lighting. And it seemed to help. So, I've got the makings for a purple. And I've already done some work on it. I'll have to cut that off a little bit because it's too long. And I wouldn't imprint. Like I said, I moved my lighting, so I'm using my phone a different way. But... And then, now I may or may not use these beads, so, because I changed some up on the blue. And then I've also got the makings for a pink one. And I may do a red. I haven't decided yet, so. Um, and... That's what I'm putting my beads on and same thing just longer is what I'm making this part with and then of course I'll trim that down so I used a small bead and then a bead cap which that's what these are And then also these. I have to remember that. Sorry, I'm trying to angle that so that y'all can see what I'm showing you. And then um, there. I know not to go past that. <laughs> but then I used, like I said, a bead cap and then a large bead and then a little bitty seed bead like. And then a small bead, just because that's the way I want it. Um, no certain reason. And then on the pink one, I just used uh, the small bead, a bead cap, the large bead, and then another bead here. I wanted to make it uniform. So um, now this part of it we're done with. So we're going to be doing... This part next so now on my charms I don't normally put the beads on till I've got them all done but with these I've been doing a little bit different Okay, so I put the chain on the O-ring and put that through the top of the bead topper. And then we're just going to close this up. Okay, we're going to set that aside, and now we're going to start with the beads that go on the chain. So, those are my large beads. I'm going to put him right there and move that tool. find us some small beads in this. Well, I had it and I dropped the little booger. Where'd it go? 
Oh, you know what? I could have used that, I guess. Okay. And I use E6000. Before I lose my other tops. Should have taken that top off last night and put a um, thing through it, cleaned it out. Because my glue is not wanting to come out. Over there okay and all I'm doing is just putting the E6000 around the tip right below the eye and then pressing it down we're gonna go with This speed, but we gotta find an eyelet, or not an eyelet, but a what do you call it? That one won't work. We may have to change beads just because of the shape of that one. Yeah, I don't like that. And all of these, I think, are going to be too small. Let's see. If this one doesn't work, we're just going to change the bead. I try to pull one out, and I pulled about 20. Yeah, I'm not liking the way that looks. So we'll use that bead, but... We are going to well, I really like that one. Let's see here. Maybe we could do that one. But let's try to find a little bit bigger one. Since No, that one won't work. But that one will. Okay. So, we're going to put some of the E6000 on that bead to keep the bead cap on. And if I get it on my hands, I try to wipe it off. No, I'm not liking that. Let's do this. I try to wipe it off as soon as I get it on there. No, I'm not going to be able to use that one. I was thinking something else. Okay. Let's do... This is why it takes me so long. Because I can't make up my mind what I'm going to use. And we're going to put some down 
in there. Plus, we're going to put some around the top. Just to make sure that it doesn't come off. And then squish it down. Okay. And then... Oh, that one's a cool one. Okay, that just is going to leave me enough room to curl the top of it. And there is our first bead. We're just going to keep on going. Let's see, I'll put how many on this one. Um, there's three, four, five, six. I put six on that one. don't have a whole lot of little beads. I need to pick some more of those up. So when all else fails, use this one. Oh, come on. There we go. I haven't quite figured out how to get that from oozing out even with the lid on it. Drives me crazy. That one kind of swallows that. Let's see if we can find. I think that's the same one I have. Yeah. Let's see if I can find a little bit bigger bead. Okay. I try to hold it in a little couple of minutes there so that it can dry. As long as I don't drop it. Let's do that one. Okay. But 
we want to get something for the middle of it. I'm going to like that or not. Let's try Offer. Oh, here's one. That'll go good with it. Might not be able to put that on. Oh yeah, I like that with it. What do y'all think? I'm going to move this again, y'all, because I keep going off. Because I've got this right up underneath me, and I keep trying to go there for it. Um, I wish I had a dark of that one. But I need it to be tiny. Let's see. Nope. I like that one. That one's not flat. That might be too big, but we'll try it. If so, we might have to go back to... Oh, yeah. That's going to be too big. And I don't like it anyway. Okay. I'm just going to go... Okay, apparently didn't get enough on this, so bear with me. Of course, it probably didn't help that I was moving it, trying to figure out what to put on it. I don't think that is going to allow me to do that. So 
And I think we're just going to go with this. Now, there we go. Let's get this extra glue off. Okay. I get some more pins out. I am probably still not staying in frame, y'all, and I apologize. I'm trying to get this glue off my hands. Quit dries my fingers together. <laughs> okay. I try to rub it to get it to come off and that way it's not drying on my hands. I got three so far. And we've been using all dark beads. So let's do some light ones. Let's see if we can use this little bitty bead cap on it. Might be a little bit too big for that. But it'll work for that one. Alrighty.
Oh, here's a pretty one. Let's see what we can find. I had my hand on one and it got away. Where did it go? It was perfect to go with that one. Oh, that's pretty. Let's try to use that one. I don't know with what, then we might have to have a small one. Okay, I'm going to end up dumping that on the floor. We're just going to keep using these little seed beads. No, well, it is if I can get it on there. Here we go. Okay. And let's see. We want that to go with the bottom, so oh, let's do this one. We use a small thing with it. I don't believe, yeah, that'll work. Isn't that cool? Okay, y'all, I am at 30 minutes already. And y'all see I haven't gotten very far. We've almost got one done, but we haven't. But I'm going to finish this one up, and then I will post pictures of what it looks like. Thank y'all, and I'll review this before I post it to make sure that I'm at least in frame some of the time. <laughs> Y'all have a great